Chaos Marauders Bloodthirsty. This time, Spootown looks an oldie but a goodie, the Chaos Marauders. Hi all, Spootown here. This time we're looking at Citadel Warhammer Age of Sigmar. And we're looking at the Chaos Marauders set. Um, they're available in this I bought a little while ago. They're available online and these models are nice looking. I've got to say a shout out to uh, Troll Horde Games on eBay. And I bought a bo this box originally from them. There are some missing parts off a of sprue. I know, very rare. But they went ahead and in a couple weeks sent me a whole new box. Which is really nice. And so in this box we get... Let's see... Alright, bases and instructions. Which, I know, we can all complain a lot about it. Ooh, some of the things that um, GW does, but they do give you good instructions. and makes it much simpler. So many companies these days decided to skip the two cents worth of paper and not publish them. So here's a good detailed list on how to put these things together. It's pretty nice. And they're nice enough to give you your base. What do we got? Three sets of shields. They're pretty nice. Lots of good detail. You got your spikes in the front, your chaos stars. See the backs. You got some wood. You got your your hand grips. So that's where you glue them to. So you're getting eight on each one of these sprues three times eight 24 out of 20 so you get four extra shields and what do we get on the sprue yeah definitely two different sprues so you've got one with the troops and the body types you've got one with the arms and the weapons a cape must be a commander cape you got some heads and four of these sprues and five of those sprues. So the first sprue, which you get five of. So on this sprue, you're getting your bodies. I don't know if you can see the details. Pretty nice. Each one has their little loincloths. They're different. So it looks like four bodies up there. You got your hand axes. Nice arms. Real mu bulky muscular. You've got a head here. Nicely done. You can see that. There's our bodies. And chains, pretty burly chests, another horned helmet, and then we've got, here's a setup for your standard bear, nice skulls of course, hooks on the end, and there's the pole, and so I think this is a standard alternative, which is really neat. It's got your chaos horns, it's got a skull, and a couple more chained up. Look, I love it. Here is your hammer for your musician. Here's the drum. That fits with the arm. So well, that's that sprue. Let's see the back of these. So nice. A little bit of variety. So you get four different body poses. There's the back of the skulls. Inside of the axe hands. 
So it looks pretty straightforward glue job. We're not going to make it too rough on us on this call. Backs with the straps. Which are nice. And here's the backs of the standards. A little cloth to paint. That's where the post fits up that hole. So that's that sprue. Let's see what we got on the other one. We've got a, a gnarly cape with skulls and the fur collar. We've got more hand axes. Another head. He's kind of messed up looking. Good. And this looks like shoulder pads. Chaos markings. Skull nut. Here's a nice hairy guy. Nice face. And more heads. More shorter arms for your shields. Here's some chain flails. Which says that's one of their main armaments, is the flails. And these are nicely done. I like the chain is good. Looks like it's really good plastic. Looks like it's easy to clip. There's one with a dagger. A couple other free arms. Shoulder pads. So you get a nice uh, abundant little options with shoulder pads. There's a two-piece back cape. I think it's two-piece. And here's a nice chaos sword. Fun to paint. Already looked at him. So that's what you get on sprue two. So you get four of those sprues. Five of the others. And that makes up for 20 guys. And let's count. Let's see how many heads you get. You got one on the other. Two, three. Four. Five. Five on one sprue, I think. My count's not wrong. And it looks like also you got to put this drum together in two parts. Uh, there's the back, there's the front. So there's ten heads on those sprues. Two, four. Uh, so there's got to be about twenty heads, so I don't know if you get any spares on that. But we will put these together. So if you were in that Age of Sigmar, if you're into sword and sorcery or other games, you know this. these might fit with them really nicely. So, we'll put some of these together, and we shall return. Hi all. If you like Spoot Town videos, please consider liking, subscribing, and maybe giving a donation here so we can keep material coming in to review. So we're back with our Chaos Marauders for Age of Sigmar. This is a pretty good kit. Was not very hard to do, put together, or anything like that. The models are very nice. The plastic is pretty good. And the details, well, it's Games Workshop. And they're pretty good. Nice cape. Skulls galore. We love it. So this should make some fun painting. You gotta have them if you got a Slaves to Darkness army. They are your foot troops and the troops you grind up in the attack. They're pretty good. So here's my champion chieftain with his two weapons. Here's a nicely posed warrior in relax. 
nice shield, nice space, good pose. It's a real reminiscent of Frank Frazetta. He's got his fur rag cape on, a little cleanup. There we go. This guy is a nice standoff about ready to attack look to him. That's really nice. The shield details are very good too. His musculature, he's got his shoulder pad on, back strap, little rope, some cleanup, a little gap filling here. But the glue is pretty good to the plastic. Nice space, nice pose. Games Workshop. Alright, here's the standard bearer. His standard. Got the skulls and the hooks. The big cloth. The drape. Back of that. For the most part, these guys don't have a lot of you know, super interesting posing going on. You'd have to do some modifications to get that going. But for the most part, I think they're um, a nice set. You get 20 in the box. It's there like must-have troops. Nice little armor on the stomach. Stomach plate. Our drummer. Pretty easy to put together. And he's got a pretty nice face too. I think you can paint him better than what's shown on the website. He's got his drum hammer there. And this conga drum. Ricky, let's go to the club. A skull on his belt. Another spare axe, just in case he needs to get into action. Nice chaos shield on the back with the face. And the wood. So he's doing his babaloo. Nice hair knot at the top. Real ward road warrior. And so you've got a few poses here. A few weapons. You got 20 in a box. So you got the Mr. Clean Eyebrows. Chaos emblem. This shield's got the chain and hook. He's got the axe, spiked axe, some leather dude pants, some knee pads, moccasins, looking good. So you get a nice assortment of helmets and heads also, and some good spare parts. So you get some nice bits with this kit. And again, goes together real easy, um, even instructions. Let's go Games Workshop at least does that for you. I'm sure I bought this at a good price because I bought it a little while ago. But if you're new to the sport and new to Age of Sigmar or just want to boost up your Chaos Forces, this is a box for you. Alright. Again, you got a lot of guys standing and threatening. Not a lot of movement out of these figures, but the bodies are pretty dynamic. The anatomy is pretty bulky, so it's worth noting also. It's got this kind of helmet. So once painted, these will look really nice. Here's another one. I like this helm, this shield. I think what it is, the legs seem stuffy, stumpy. The bottom legs, thighs, and the head seems big, but it's not too outrageous. Figures are still really cool. Another alternate head. Long range hero type. Nice chaos shield. And his loincloth is ready to rock, lock and load. 
This guy's nice. So that other helmet, same as the other guy. All my armies are, of course, for the blood god, corn. So they all have a good basic look that it's pretty unifying. Shin guards, knee guards, nice spikes on the shield, or an encased helmet, the big horn. The three spikes, three arrows of chaos for a shield. That's what this set looks like. It's a good deal, it's a good buy. You get 20. Wheels on the bus go round and round. I think this tastes like chicken.